And 27 year old Dylan Fargo is currently in custody in Hall County, Nebraska. He was the choir and show choir instructor at Washington High School when he allegedly formed a relationship with a 14 year old boy. We want to warn you that some of the information in the court papers are disturbing. Dalen Fargo, you see here in the green checkered shirt in a story we did back in 2019, is facing three felony charges tonight for allegedly having sexual contact with a child under 16. Last week, Sioux Falls Police received information Fargo had been romantically involved with a teenager at school and an arrest warrant was issued. That warrant was uh, turned over to the sheriff's office and they were able to locate Mr. Fargo in Hall County, Nebraska, and he was arrested last night. Police say the relationship started when the victim was just 14 years old at Washington High School. It involved uh, texting and sending pictures. Um, the adult sent it to the juvenile, the juvenile sent it to the adult. But those messages, police say, were just the beginning of a relationship that went on for two years. According to court papers obtained by Kelloland News, Fargo and the boy became good friends and would text each other frequently. Fargo even gave the teen a tablet to take home, telling him he would want the tablet. Court papers say when the boy turned on the tablet, he saw videos of Fargo masturbating along with other nude pictures. The victim told police he deleted the images but kept the device. The court documents go on to say as time passed, Fargo expressed his desire to have sex with the boy. During his police interview, Fargo stated he was in a loving relationship with the boy and admitted to sending nude photos to him and receiving photos back. Fargo told authorities their relationship was consensual love and, quote, they let their emotions get control of them. Fargo told police they stopped sending images to each other in March of 2018 when asked why he stopped, he said, we knew this day would come, and I think we both regretted it. Fargo is being held on a $100,000 cash bond until he can be extradited back to South Dakota. We've attached the entire criminal complaint as well as a statement from the Sioux Falls School District under this story at Kelloland.com.